date is April 26, 2019. Uh, we've been called by a customer that has a uh, dump truck that has been involved in a collision. And apparently what we were told is hit another dump truck. And uh, originally we were told it just needed to be uh, lifted and towed across the road. It's at a quarry going to a, a asphalt plant across the road. Originally, just needed to be lifted and towed across the road, but uh, we've been called and updated that it actually has went off the road and down a small embankment. So we were originally just going to respond with the 35 ton, but when they called back and told us that, we decided to uh, go ahead and send both of them out, and uh, that way, in case we need the extra pulling power or a different angle, we'll have the 16 ton available. Uh, I'm in the 16 ton now, and Dad is ahead of me in the 35 ton. Uh, the, the quarry we're going to is about 20, 25 miles away. And uh, so when we get there, we'll turn you back on and let you see all the action. We just had a storm run, roll through Clover here, and hopefully it'll cool it down a little bit where we're going to be working. And uh, so I don't know if they got any of the storm, but we'll see when we get there get this truck pulled out and get it uh, dumped. Dumped and it is loaded. It was loaded with gravel, which is what they told us. So we'll see if we're going to have any troubles if we're going to lift it and dump it or if we're going to be able to crank it. We don't know that yet, so we'll see when we get there. Stay tuned. Cowboy. How bad is it? Uh, no, yeah. Walk right into a picture. I think I got a hookup for him. Just close to this. This one end is about to come back out. So we're going to have to get over. We've got to get to move yonder. We're going to take the freight liner front end, bring it front end, start keeping it up the hill. Well, it's got, I think it'll come. You think so? We may have to hook to that front spring shack on the front. I don't know whether it's got air on it. If not, we've got to put air on it. Put air on it. I'd rather put air on it. We're going to go up there and hook to that trunnion in the I'm middle. And go around it. Yeah, hook, probably hook the carriage. I'll change on it. Right yeah, come out right there with them. Yeah, the, the trunnion, center trunnion. This piece right here. Go down and around it. Yeah, where it mounts. May can. May can. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Make sure gate here. Oh, bumpers on the ground. Whew. It's gonna be a heck of a pull. They said we didn't have any diesel fuel leaking, but we'll go ahead and check it. Got it close. I don't know how we don't have a diesel fuel leak. I'll be careful. There's the battery, so I'll be careful there. Something sprays in here. I'm just, just making sure I get an idea of what yeah, He's just, uh, he was on the material, so he's probably. Brian, what's that gross weight on that? Loaded with 25. What's it got 25 tons in it? Yeah. Okay. Good, good. All right.
I wish she was red. paper glass in this place put dust killing me Snatch blocks. What's that? No, I got the wolves out of the freight liner. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and double both lines. I mean, double both lines. That way we can kind of. Try to manipulate it a little bit out of the hole. I think we can do something useful while we're here. Those will back up there close. Hook up, hook up to it and pull forward. Big shocker. People call if they need us. People call if they need in as long as they get the gate closed. You want to go ahead and start hooking? I'm going to try the trunnion. What you want to put on? Kyle chains. Can I get them? One or two? Huh? Two. Probably my dad, too. Put it out here and I'll take it. All right, got it? Right 
around the rear. If we can get that uh, strap puller push it through there, I can put the hook on that and bring it back through that way around this trunnion. How are you? <laughs> Could be better. <laughs> Another day in paradise, ain't it? Yeah. I am Andy. Well, at least this ain't on the, the roadway. Don't tell everybody I'm Tony's brother. This is my son, Kyle. Hey, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm the one that owns everything. Tony's the one that owns everything. He's the one that owns everything. He's the one that owns Could have been worse. Could have been on the roadway. I know. Yeah. Good thing it was here. Yeah. No problem. Yeah, sir. You want to hook that trunnion in or? Hey, what do you What's that? Grab his whole thing. All right. That big sounds even. Let's get a couple chain pullers. I'm gonna get that aluminum rod. We got one here. We got one there. I know I got one 16. If I need it. There's that. Oh, come on. Stretch cow. Oh, it's hooked my handle off. I done lost my handle. Hold on a second, Dave. I got you right here. I think we're gonna have to grab that front ant, that front wheel on the underside. Can I get that hook to you? Huh? Yeah, it's a heavy side here. I'm blasting my legs down here. Yeah. Pull it. Yeah. Hook to the uh, where the rear end's mount under there, the center trunnion. See if we're gonna need the 16 ton on the front axle or not. That dump truck coming through now. Woo. We've seen that one before, ain't we? That wheel messed up like that. You wanna back up and I'll hook them up? Let's move. Hey. Let's get Jeff 
Yeah. Yeah. What what post is that? Big round metal post. Gate post. Okay. Okay, let's uh Y'all pull the front line in right here. That way in case we need it, it'll be here. Gotcha. Come on out. that blue one. Unlock the unlock that winch. Okay. working from there.
was rolling. He'd have been in the truck. The driver did. side on my driver's side truck. It's uh it's doing most of the work currently. What I'm doing now is just we're just watching it make sure it comes out even. That's good. It's nice you can work well with the safety manager and they watch out for you the same as us. I'm wondering if up so I can get a good board point. Currently lost the danger zone, but This way, we're pulling it up here. Port the truck this way, back in from that angle. That way, we're not pulling off the side, we're pulling straight off the back of this truck. What we'll do is, I'm gonna get a cut off of this line. Okay, let's see what it does. Okay. I'm gonna put the truck this way, right, right in here where it's gonna come into the middle of it. We'll put a two-port line down to a three-quarter inch rim sling. I'll go ahead and rig that while you're turning the truck around. Yeah, on, the, on this side right here. I may do it on the bottom. On the back, it'll make it time. That's true. There we go. That'll work. Let me grab a three-quarter. We'll just put a snatch block in that line. That one right there. Hey, bro. Just like that, yeah. That way we're pulling straight off the back, set off the side. This truck can't do that. That 16 ton spray, but it's not good for a side pull, so we're going to do it straight off the back. Because we've got the space to do it with. Let's just put this on here, stabilize it. We brought it, we might as well use it.
should be good right there. I already pulled it. Two more foot and I'm going to move the truck. Making sure she'll sit there for a second. If it were to take off rolling, it'd take that truck with it. Where do you want to go direct? Straight up, straight up. Just pull around forward. I'm going to wait till you get in the truck. On the back. I'm just making sure it's not going to roll again. Gotcha. Easy, easy. Hey, hey. Lighten up. yours. Turn away for up. Alright, I'm gonna need to get through. Watch out there, there's people around. We can hook it right there. Yeah, I was back in there and put a aluminum angle right there and chain sling it. Take it across. We're about to chain sling it anyway with that much weight on it. 
Yeah, it's settling. You put a pretty much good bit of torque on that thing. Frame's link. Just leave this. Let's get out of the road. We can do this. What kind of rope is that? Man rope. Oh, look at here. Holy moly, especially that little freaking oh, yeah. thing. Good God. It's, I love that synthetic rope stuff. Still in one piece? You tried to kill it. I know you did. You did it on purpose. It's got any shot. Yeah, it's still fine. Good. Where'd you drop it at? Hooking up? I'm surprised we didn't run over. It wouldn't be the first one we pulled something over. Guys, nice to meet y'all. Like something. You ever need anything else? Just give us a call. Oh, yeah. No yeah. problem. Like I said, just don't hold it. Thanks, thanks for putting up. It ain't cost to do it, but. It's, it's well worth it. Some kind of the, it's a synthetic hey, fiber, it's Dyneema. Fiber? Yeah, yeah. Dyneema. That's pretty neat stuff right there. And uh, if I ever get that truck painted, I'm gonna replace that wire on that truck with synthetic too. I'll let you That's about like sandblasting, ain't it? Yeah, it is. It's uh, this ain't part of the beach crap. <laughs> you can tolerate it down there, you can't you? You can dump that truck by lifting the front of it up, it won't start. Well, you can try to get it up, especially well, since it's downhill. One good thing. That it is 789s. It'll come out easier. Once you yeah. pop that tailgate, once you get air on it, we yeah. can pop that tailgate, and you can get a little bit of lean on it. That rock, thank goodness it's rock, because it'll come right yeah. out. Yeah. Well, we can we can pick it up pretty high with the underlift, and we make it bump it. You know. That's fine. I think it. it'll come right out because it's just rock. Yeah, at least it's not asphalt. And then whatever y'all think about the best place to. Gotcha. Well, that's right, y'all are taking it with you, so I ain't got to worry about it. Good. That's a good deal. Good deal for you, Wade. This thing, I'll watch you. Good job. We have to have arrow with load. We'll scrape this down. Hey, once we get the Peterbilt around, we'll hook that tow hook and we'll swing it out here. Yeah, swing it out to us. There you go. Come back. Deal. I'll start getting this stuff wound up. I'm just gonna leave my blocks on here for right now. Leave them blocks on there for right now. Uh, probably not, but we'll get something to hook in them. I'd rather not because we're going to be tight with this dump truck. I'd rather just run over and let them swing for a minute until we get back to the yard and then we get a round swing or something. See if they hook in there. Even if they just tip just a little bit, we'll snug them. Got it? Ain't going to do it. Let me see. Let me see what we got. 
Hook on the ring and go find the halfway point and pull it back up and hook it. Whew. Those are heavy chains to wrestle. You heard a man in a minute of these chains. Stand those up. Yep. Okay. Let me get the other side too. Yeah, leave them like that. Yes, sir. Leave us at a high stance. Damn it, Dave. No. I want to set it to high stands. And the chain hooks on the side. It's independent underlift, you need them. Silver hooks on them? Yeah. Yeah. On one end. Yeah, one hook chains. You make sure it wasn't a bird in them, didn't you? Go around that or the 
That way it can't. That thing's popping and cracking just sitting there. That way it can't shift on us. I'm going to go ahead and get a chain and start hooking. You still want to grab it? I'm going to try to walk the back of the angle. damage side here. How about that? This one's going to be hard to go around the axle without some help. Because I've got a little micro space to pull it in. sandblasted by the time it's done with all this rock and dirt. Let's go ahead and get over up here. Get down. No, 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 no. Shouldn't be that way. Let me see where we need to be. Right center of that tank. Hello, darling. Four-wheel drive. It's gonna take a medium-duty record. Yep. Uh, it's, it's too long for a regular rollback. Yep. It's too long for 21 foot. Tell them that. Yep. It's a. I mean, it's a. It's a. Yeah, it's a 550 truck. All right. Uh, no, it's it's uh, the medium-duty rate. I think 43. Okay. Alright, love you, bye. I'm going to have some issues over here because I've got so much dirt piled up to get around the axle. Is the axle not loose? No. I think it's shifting a little bit, but not much. Right, it knocked the pad loose. Yeah, that's what I know. All right. Watch that battery box. I don't want you to, in case something were to short out on that. They got a little sawzall, don't we? Somebody keeps it in the shop. There you go, boss. Macho, macho man. Give me a change. get that chain behind that where it comes up I can grab it oh gosh you see 
in my hook. From the inside out on the tow hook. Good. This side. Yeah, go inside and come out. Gotcha. All right, you go ahead and work on your side. I'll. All right, that's how it's done. Ooh, that, that sign. That sign feels good in my back. What's that? That sign. That sign feels good in my back. Ooh, that hurt. Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna run and get it. Yeah, let's do that. That's heavy as it is. I need to order one for this truck. I just haven't had a chance to. My eyes kind of flimsy. Have a year of service. I'm just glad a storm come through today. Well, I'll be honest, I'm glad it came through because now it brought some breeze with it. Other than being pretty much sandblasted down here the whole time the breeze does feel nice Pieces rolled. Come down. It ain't gonna do no better. It's got, yeah, it can do better. It's just, this has got it. I know come around it where it comes on front of it. flip the small lip up. Come down. It will ruin that aluminum if we don't. I'm with my finger out of the way. Yeah. The other side, flip it over. Put the big side back. Over here, but we still got a we got a half an inch on that aluminum right there. Right. 
Oh, last Tony, if we gotta clean it up, we'll come back down here with the pickup. Let's get this thing over there. Move it across the road and get it empty. I can. All right. We're going across now to the uh, well where they want us to dump the load. <coughs> the 25 tons of gravel, and then we can figure out how to get in here to it and whatnot. Turn the air conditioner on a little bit more. So it's out successfully. That's good. There was no secondary damages done. Uh, nothing. No rigging failures. Oh, speed bump. Uh, nothing to worry about as far as that. So very fortunate, very blessed that everything went as smooth as it did. Now we just got to figure out where they want to put it. The load and then we got to take it to the uh the corporate uh location uh monday so we got it hooked up though and man it's coming across the road with it now i don't know how much video i've got left i'll try to get you the uh unload procedure we don't know how we're going to unload it uh may have to pull start it um you get the crank to where it can dump on its own or we may have to pick it up high enough with a wrecker and uh, hand bomb it. Hopefully we don't have to do that. But we're at the plant now. I'm going to grab me some water if I can find my bottle. Get me some H2O. don't get it uh, as always thank you for watching be sure to like comment subscribe to our channel uh, comment let us know what you thought that was the uh, first heavy recovery video you've seen on our channel or will be the first heavy recovery video you see on our channel um, so let us know what you think in the comments below hit the notifications bar and uh, we will see you next time with the next video. Please move over, slow down when you see flashing lights, give us room to work, and God bless.